Hello, everybody. As we near the end of the year and we've reached the Christmas holiday, just wanted to put out a little video to say hello to everybody, wish you happy holidays, and hope that your new start to the new year is a good one. As I look back over 2023, we've had a lot of ups and downs through the year. I was able to get quite a few photographs that I've been working on getting for quite a few years. Um, we've talked about that through different videos this year and blog posts and some on social media posts because I haven't gotten the videos out yet, but those will be coming soon. Um, the Mayflower Gulch shot that I got back in April, I've talked about that one before, but that was a shot I've been trying to get for four years. Took three different times out to do it, and it was one of the coldest nights out that I have ever experienced. But I was finally able to get the shot that I've been trying to get. Uh, up at Mount Evans in September, which is now called Mount Blue Sky, but that's a shot that I'd had in my mind for a number of years, waiting for all the conditions to come together with a nice clear sky, a calm night at 12,800 feet at Summit Lake, which you just don't get very often, and a little bit of snow on the mountain peak to make it just that much more interesting. So that was probably one of the shots I'm most proud of for this year. And the opportunities to take a number of you out on classes and workshops out under the stars this year, that's always very rewarding to, to share those experiences with all of you in person and, and help you learn how to capture images like this for yourself. The experiences I've had with people this year have been very special. I talked about some of the highs and successes for this year, some of the harder things, as some of you have, that have been following me for a while know back in October, I dislocated my shoulder and that has made it tricky over these last couple of months to get stuff processed on the computer because that's really hard on my arm to get out and shoot because it's tricky to carry my gear. I was out doing a photography session tonight of an event and found that doing this for a while is really, really tough on my shoulder. So that's that's been an adjustment over these last couple months, learning to deal with the soreness and the rehab to try and get it to act the way it should. So I'm hoping the new year will bring more success with that. As I do at the end of every year, I do a top 10 countdown of my most popular photographs that I've shared on my social media accounts. We're in the midst of that, so watch for some of your favorites as they come up here at the end of the year. It's a great collection of images this year that I'm really proud of. Something else I usually do at the beginning of every new year is go back through my collection, look at some of the images that maybe don't really fit in with what I'm doing now, or maybe you're older and I've replaced them with something better. So I'll be removing a few, again, from my website at the start of the new year. So if there's an older photograph that you really like, that you'd really like to get a print of, now might be the time. And I've absorbed a lot of price increases for my business and for my vendors over the last few years even though my margins ended up at the end of this year being a lot closer than they have been in years past, my sales were down a little bit as they were across a lot of businesses that I know of this year. So looking at some possible pricing adjustments to start the new year too. So if you've been thinking about purchasing something right here at the end of the year might be a great time. And as we near the end of the year, I've just got a few of my 2024 calendars left. I'll put a link to this in the description. If you have not gotten yours yet, now is a great time to get your 2024 calendar for the new year. It's a great collection of images that I'm really proud of and a lot of great moments to share for this coming year. So if you have not gotten yours yet, make sure to get yours before they are gone. It's my 2024 calendar. I think we'll wrap it up there. Thank you to all of you who have supported my business this year by sharing my posts, by making purchases, by following my accounts. I've added a lot of new followers this year on my social media and on my YouTube, and I'm, I'm very thankful for that. So 
Thank you to all of you for joining me on the journey this year, and hopefully 2024 will be an even better experience for all of us. Thank you for watching. We'll see you next time.